Hey guys, welcome to my channel RF teaches you. I'm Arif and in this video you're gonna learn about unification of Germany. So if you are an Indian, you might know that India was ruled by many king, many kings, many empires like British, Ottoman, Portuguese and it had many rulers like the, like the Mughals and it had many religions, cultures and it was not uni united and it is not actually united even today. So it was similar, the problems were similar in the olden days, olden days with Germany. It also ha didn't have this similar language, just one language I, it had today, Dutch. And uh, it had many cultures, many like Catholic churches and many, and it was really, really corrupted. So as you know that every f story, every film has a main character. So in this uh, unification, uh, in the unification of Germany, there was a really, really good hero, I you know, main character. It was, he, his name was Chancellor Bismarck. He was the general of the army of uh, Germany. So he may, uh, played the really, really like important role in the unification of Germany. So, as you know, he was really similar to Subhash Chandra Bose of India. So, how was he similar? You know, like Subhash Chandra Bose was really violent and he, like, he was off violence. Like, he praised violence, not non violence. So, this man was also, Bismarck was also a man of blood and iron. You know, I think you know the phrase blood and iron. It means iron means the armaments and blood. He was like, work hard and you might get it. So he was a man of blood and iron and he was really, really cunning. So he was really cunning and he was like, he played an important role in the unification of Germany. So as you know, Germany is situated in the middle of, not actually middle, exactly middle. It is situated in Europe and there are many neighboring countries around it like France, Spain. So it, and these neighboring countries were offended for the unification of Germany. They were like, they were against the unification of Germany. So Bismarck knew that it was impossible, almost impossible and it was really, really hard, but he made it possible for the unification of Germany and Germany was united after three wars in seven years. So Bismarck knew that it was really hard to unite Germany uh, because many neighboring countries were offended. So as many neighboring countries were offended, he knew that it was not possible and he needed to raise his power. So at that time, Germany was not actually called as Germany. It was Prussia. Not only Germany was known as Prussia, Prus uh, Germany along with Poland uh, and other two countries or states was known as Prussia. So, so Bismarck was a general for the army of Prussia. Now, Prussia wanted friendship so that it could raise, uh, raise its power, raise its power so that it could unite Germany. So, uh, Bismarck had the friendship of Italy. Spain and Spain was also offend, offended like it was also against but he had this friendship in another way so you can't make friendship by giving an, uh, without giving an offer like it uh, so Bismarck gave an offer to Italy that it would give Venezia to them if they had a friendship with them and uh, so Venezia was a state in Prussia it was a state in Prussia. Venezia was a state in Prussia and he, Bismarck said that if you be my friend, I will give you Venezia. So Venezia was handed to Italy and he gave, gave many offers to Spain, France and all that. We will talk about it later. So the main point for this was for unification of Germany, it, it had three wars in Seven in seven years that's a long time so three wars the three wars were the 
first war was war with Denmark. It was also a country in Euro Europe, and the second war was Austro Prussian War. And the third war was Franco Prussian War. And these three wars were held in seven years. These three wars were accompany, uh, accomplished in seven years, one by one. And we'll talk about the wars in part two of unification of Germany. And uh, lastly, uh, okay, in the uh, part two of unification of Germany. So, I'll see you about these three words in detail. So, thank you guys for watching the video.